Are we gonna get another M Shadow or are we gonna get a Mercedes? All right, so we got both the hats lined up. So we're getting something to be eight and we're gonna drive, so. Here it is, guys, you ready? Welcome back guys to another episode of Horsepower Cartel. As some of you guys know, we spoke about a rear wheel drive V8. Uh, I haven't decided what to get. Are we gonna go with the M or are we gonna go with the Mercedes? So I'm gonna let Shadow decide on what we're gonna get. Are we gonna get another M Shadow or are we gonna get a Mercedes? Let's decide. All right, so we got both the hats lined up, Shadow. Which one are you gonna go for? Go oh, get it. Oh. He's gonna go with the M. Is that the one, Shadow? Is that the one? Get it, come on, which one? No, oh, come on, make up your mind. Which one is it, which one is it? Which one is it, Shadow, come on. Make up your mind, which one? Get it, come on, go. Yeah, okay, all right, cool, good job. All right, Shadow, I'm gonna be back. We're with the M hat, so we're gonna go get an M now, all right, Shadow? Okay, you're gonna go get an M. See you soon. And I'm back in my elevator again. So right now, I'm about to go see my new car, right? I really wanted to get a Mercedes, but I had to stick to my roots and that's with the M, you know. I just have to do it. So I'm uh, getting something V8 and rear wheel drive. So you probably figure it out, you know, the, I mean, it narrows it down to what it could possibly be. There's only a few cars in the BMW lineup that are V8s and rear wheel drive. So let's see, I'm gonna keep you guys holding on to guessing what it is. The truck's outside my building. Let's go. And here she is, guys. Just parking it up, you know. Gonna get it out. There she is, guys. Can't wait for these doors to open up. Oh man, waited three long days for this. The driver just handed me the keys. Here she is. And if you can't figure it out by the keys, then I don't know what to tell you, but that's the Valtronic exhaust. But yeah, there's the keys. Just waiting for them to open this. The door's kind of jammed up. Of course, my luck. The doors are jammed up. This has to be the longest, like, five minutes of my life. Still waiting for it. It is open. I can kind of see it through the crack, but, uh, yeah. Here it is, guys. You ready? And there she is. My brand new E93 M3. Yes, it's a convertible, guys. That's, there it is, guys. My E93 M3. Like I said, it's got some nice mods on it already. Got the Crescent exhaust, BBS wheels, custom paint job. Damn, it's kind of dirty. We need to go get a wash. But yeah, there she is, guys. Check out the BBS wheels. Yeah, I wish Rural was here to do some sick B-roll action, but sorry, guys. Yeah, look at the rear tire on this. Oh, my God. Shout out to my boy Nirbe, who I bought this from. He was nice enough to cover it up. You know, like a new car. <laughs> oh man, look at that steering wheel. Let's get in this and start it up. Cold start. Let's go. Let's start this baby up. Let's fire it up. Let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and open up the valves. We need to get some uh, fuel. Oh my god, I just opened up the valves. It's so loud. Listen to the difference in the valves. Oh man. I mean, I, I don't get me wrong, I missed the Nissan, but uh, I don't know, man. This is nice. And plus, we got a convertible top. This is nice. So, I'm not complaining. The car was always maintained at uh, Redline Auto House, so, you know, he had to hit him up with the CF treatment. Oh, we got the... We got the cup holders too, what? It's kind of jammed up because this car hasn't been driven that a, a lot. You know, my boy got a few other cars that he got in his uh, stable, so he doesn't really get a chance to drive his car. But Alcantara steering wheel, as you can see, with the carbon fiber, beautiful. Everything is CF, even the ashtray back there is CF, so full red interior. Loving it, guys, going for the first fill up. Of course, living in India, no one sells you a car with a full tank. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But he didn't have time to go fill it up. I'm pretty sure my boy Nerbe would have filled it up. But anyways, we're about to go fill it up with some 97 octane. Gonna put some heat in this car. Let's go. We're here doing the first fill up. As you can see, it's gonna be a long time. It's a big, 
V8. I don't know how many liters it is, but uh, yeah, we're in the first fill up right now, so let's see. There it is, 60 liters, and we're still going. Oh, 59 liters. 60 liters exactly. Full? Let's see. 7,000 rupees. 117 a liter. That's crazy. Come on. You guys voting for the wrong people, man. I have to deal with this stuff. Alright, so this is the car with the valves open. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna get in so much trouble. Listen to this downshifts. <laughs> oh man. Only if you guys can hear this in person, man. This is ridiculous. So just taking it for a quick car wash. Then I'm gonna hit you guys with some nice B-roll action. But damn, I'm, I, I'm driving on the MDM setting. This suspension is so stiff. I'm gonna turn it off now. You cannot drive in the city with the suspension, man. It is so stiff. But so far, so good. Loving it. I just showed the car to my mom. She's kind of upset with the tint. But other than that, she was a very happy camper. She was happy seeing the car. And she was just like, oh, BMW's always giving you problems. Just be careful, you know. Oh, man, those downshifts. Of course, I got the valves shut right now because we don't want to get in any trouble before I go get a car wash. So, yeah. I don't know, guys. The Nissan is irreplaceable. You know, nothing can replace that car. Luckily, it went to a very close friend. And he's going to take care of it. He's going to take it on as a project and make it even better than what I had done it up to, you know. We're going to have another project car lined up. Because, you know, I got that JDM itch, so I have to have to have something JDM in my life. And something manual as well, so stay tuned for that. It's going to be a very unique project. Let's hope everything goes through the way I want it to. And, oh, stiff suspension, got to get used to that. Just had to hope everything goes through the way I want it to. And then you guys will have the best content possible on here, so. Man, I'm excited with this car, man. It feels good to be back in a BMW. This is where I belong. I feel like I guess I'm a Beamer guy. And even Shadow picked it out, man. I was not staged, by the way. Just saying. All right. He's a dog after all. A human dog. <laughs> oh, man. I feel like a little kid in the candy store, man. This is unreal. This is unreal. And shout out to my boy Akshay, Redline Auto Horse, for suggesting me this car. I was actually going to go buy another car, but uh, went ahead and got this one. And I'm glad I did. Way more mods and, you know. Sick color, sick exhaust. None of that custom exhaust bullshit. It's got a crescent exhaust. Very expensive exhaust too. It's the F1 crescent exhaust. You can look it up on YouTube because I'm not going to be doing any exhaust clips for you guys or flybys for now, you know? So if you guys want to hear a flyby or something, just YouTube it. Or, uh, you know what? I'll ask Ruel to put something in here. valves and we're gonna go do a little uh, send-off so listen to how loud this is this is just 3,000 I was just 3,200 rpms not 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 a lot <laughs> oh my god guys if, oh my god guys if I get locked up someone bail me out any of you lawyers out here, I'm going to need you to come bail me out because this thing's going to get me in a lot of trouble. I'm not even flooring it, guys. That's not even like, that's barely like 2,000 RPMs. Oh, my God. Full, I got all this room to send it, but got some cops back there. You know, I don't want to risk it, you know. I could be a dick and do it, and I usually would, but I don't want to push my luck because it is, you know, a pandemic happening and stuff, and they're doing their job, you know, and there's some more cops up there, so good thing I didn't, so yeah. And one thing I love about the E93 is obviously it's a convertible, but you know what that means, since it's a convertible, the B pillar is non-existent, I mean, B pillars are non-existent and coupes anyways, but uh, check this out, I got the extra set of windows that go down, and then we got more windows, so, I could have Shadow in the back, you know? Sticking his head out. 
Look at that. All that window. All that window space. So right now getting a wash because the car was filthy after it got off of transport. Damn. Look at this exhaust, man. Crazy. Crescent exhaust, BBS wheels. As you can see, it's concave in the back, non concave in the front. Sick. Not to do the shampoo wash, you know. some back ways to avoid the cops already your boys already getting in some heat you know so right now we're just gonna open up the valves and do a little quick send off not a send off but quick send as you can hear it oh my god here we go mdm mode traction off let's go send Those downshifts are deafening. Deafening, guys. We're gonna get in a lot of trouble with this. Pray for me. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. I couldn't really send it because there was some water on the floor and I had my tires wet too, obviously, because I was I just got it washed. But uh yeah, couldn't send it all the way. But good enough, right? Good enough send. Right now, I'm just gonna head to my house and give me some of that B-roll. So just pulled up to my house and uh yeah, here we go. We're all heading with the B-roll. I love about this car one of the best features obviously being a convertible it has this button check it out so you know you have your button for your window controls obviously it has the buttons for the rear windows too as you can see and the front obviously but then it has one button where all the windows come up so check it out all the windows go up with the flick of a switch how cool is that pretty cool there she is guys obviously this is the parking spot for her, but I was just feeling too lazy to move the LX and I moved the S-Class and the LS is still here. Uh, it's sold, like I said. The buyer is going down south. Just waiting on some paperwork from the RTO and obviously a lockdown happened, so waiting on that. But here she is, guys. E93 M3, back in action. By the way, my buddy Roman's back in America killing it. I can't wait to go back this summer, hopefully. We'll get the content you guys want. Damn, but this parking lot feels so empty without the 300 which would normally be parked here, but like I said, the time had come and I had to give it up. So yeah, let me go upstairs and freshen up and get some food I haven't eaten yet. I've been up since 8 a.m. and I haven't even had my breakfast yet because I was just so excited driving this thing. So nice to be home, man. It's so hot outside. Shadow's like, you left me. <laughs> Shadow's like, you got your new whip and you forgot about me. <laughs> I'm sorry, Shadow. I mean, no car can replace you, obviously. Thanks. Thanks for picking out the BMW, you know. I'm glad uh, I made you part of my decision because it wasn't a bad one. That NAV8, that NAV8, oh my God, it sounds so good. And here's a little Valvetronic remote, you know. Shadow, can you stop sniffing my butt? Anyways, there he is. He's excited too. You excited, Shadow? A lot more to come to the channel, so stay tuned. Let me know what you guys think of the color. You know, what mods you want me to do next. Maybe, you know, what you want to see from the channel as well so yeah i'm just so excited i'm lost for words please don't mind me today's sunday so i'm gonna kick it with my son on sunday right shadow i'm gonna kick it with him so i want some ac because it's it's hot in here shadow i don't know how you live with the ac this guy hates the ac for some reason but then again you're from punjab shadow i got a punjabi dog see you guys soon on another episode take care thanks for all your love and support and your blessings this this wouldn't have been possible without you guys and Ruel, thanks for sticking with me, man. A lot more to come, bro. I promise you. Road to 1 million? Let's see. A lot of ratchet stuff's gonna happen, though, with this M3, I'll tell you that. 
I just rhyme. Anyway, see you guys, man. Take care. <laughs>